Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Yeah, 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 blah, 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 blah. Okay, so this is the complete beginner's guide to a beginner. Then, so I'm going to show you how to, not script, but uh, like the basic tools. So you can choose out of the base plate. Classic base plate, flat terrain, modern city, village, castle, suburban, racing, pirate island, obby, starting place, line runner, capture the flag, team, FFA, arena, combat, concert, move, simulator, mansion of wonder. Now, some things like capture the flag, you could just make the buildings better and the UI better. Or like, line runner, you can make it bigger, better. But... We're not doing that. We are doing base play. Just so we can learn the basics. So, let's so click on base play. If it says it's not spawning, it is. Just my. Just what I'm doing. Okay, so we're in. Now, as you can see, you can see a lot of things at the start. Now, here's what you need to do. So, you want to go into Avatar. No, you don't. Well, you want to go over to View. You want to do... You want to click Show Grid if you want. Video Record. Screenshot. Full Screen. Bunch of things. Toolbox. You wanna click on that. You wanna. You wanna. It's not showing. But you wanna show. Uh, where is it? Let's see if we can find it. Watch tag editor. Uh, team create. Skip. 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 Alright, so there's a bunch of things that you can get. So you want to get the tags editor. I think that's what, that, that's what it is. If you don't have these, you just have to find it. I don't know. I actually forgot. Where is it? Um, so, let's go over to the homepage. This is basically where the, all the normal things is. Let's go over it. This is the select tool. So say we wanted to select it, we can click it and we can drag it around. Nice. Now, the move tool. This move tool is probably the most useful because it's so you can smoothly move it, the part. Scale tool, I'm not going to actually use it. Let's actually go over to the part now. Part. It sorts a part. Now back to the scale tool. This scales the block or whatever you're doing so we can make a little platform here oh nice little platform cool if we wanted this platform to be bigger we could do that nice. so now there's a little platform nice this is the rotate pull tool you click on something and then you can rotate it see how that rotated yeah rotate this is the toolbox. The toolbox is basically where you can get free models and free stuff, but some have viruses. So, maybe not everything you should make thing. You should never make. You should, I recommend you not, and actually learning how to script. But, you know, you can get some kill bricks and stuff. And there's some really weird things in it. Anyway, okay, let's go over to model, yeah? Oh, by the way, it's okay, so this is UI. This is UI basically screen UI, and then you can do, like, a text label. See, it spawns it in. You can make a, you can make it GUI, which is pretty cool. But then we want to go, but it's pretty cool. You want to make the text bigger, you want to do everything, but we're not doing UI. 
let's go over to model. Model basically has the old thing, transform, transform stuff. Now this is where you rotate it, that's how many studs you rotate, on oh, no, a degree sorry. This is how many every time you put the move pull. And then the part, um, this colour basically if you spawn, that will like what if you spawn in something that would be the colour of it. Um, this is the spawn pad, so if you click that, a spawn pad will spawn. If you click this, it's a particle, so say I want fire, there you go, there's some fire, let's spawn another one, say smoke, smoke. If you want this, this is basically like a run script, or like, yeah, it's like a script, like run a script, collision services, and like insert an object. This is Avatar, this is basically where you can like set up rigs and stuff, animation editor, same stuff. This is the test, so you can play the game, test it, start the game, test what device you're on, player. Oh, that's weird, um, mute it. And then this is all like the other stuff in the view, you want visibility, yes, yes, um, you know, all this stuff. And then plugins, you can get a bunch of plugins. But let's see if we can make a game with free models. Yeah, so, you can search anything in the free in here. Search anything you want. So why don't we see if we can... Make a big game. <laughs> anyway, so what I would that would I'm gonna do I'm going to scroll up um and go on to recent because this is what the models I've been using recently. So there's cup thing, there's a bunch of stuff. Um, there's a shop, I use that for a game that I used, tapping simulator around this gen. There's a bunch of decorations, I'm going to close up the toolbox, and I'm going to close up tasks, all this stuff. Okay, so there you go, now you know the basics of Roblox Studio. Um, I hope this is the, like... So this is save to Roblox and stuff, how to publish it. That's how to exit the game, that's how you can enjoy a friend in. But that's it, you know, because Roblox Studio, I hope you can think. You can send me the game links in the comments and then I'll play your games happily. Same with Scratch Games, if you send it the link in the comment, Ah, we can play at your sketch game. So, yeah, thank you for that, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.